You ready to get go in? <laughs> Are you? We got 12 minutes. In your face. This is a wrestling workout. Yeah. We're wrestle. 90 DT here. Wait, that's what you're gonna do to me. All right, we got an awesome workout. Beginners, do it once. Intermediate, do it twice. Advanced, do it three times or as many as you want. Um, full body, what are we using today? Um, just a sandbag today. That's it? And our bodies. And our bodies. So we're gonna get our butts moving. We're gonna get a good sweat on. And if you're just thinking, just thinking that you're just wanting to get started with us, do the workout. Just do the body weight. Move for four minutes. We're right here with you. Advanced people, you know how we do it. You ready? Yes. All right. Let me get the timer going. Kick back. We're doing lunges. Get right back. We're going to kick it straight ahead. Alternate legs. Right back. Make sure the bag's nice and high over your head. Try to kick out as far as you can and really wrap it out. Try to get right back into the lunge as far as you can. Knee should almost touch the floor, but not quite. Look at one spot on the wall when you're doing this. Try not to fall over. You should feel this in your shoulders as well. Like I said, if you don't have the bag, don't worry about it. Do body weight. And try not to let your knees collapse in. All right. Seasons. We got burpees. Straight old fashioned burpees. Ready? And then you're gonna tuck me up. It's two. That's five, we're going all the way for 50 seconds. Really? Pop up. Get the knees up. Come on. Get the knees up. Go hills. Cheated. Really power up. Do the modification if you can't do it. You don't want to know what just happened. Awesome. The shoelace came on. Uh oh, keg press. Why is that? Keg press. So we're plunging forward. This time, my bag is sweaty. Yes, I have a sweaty bag. <laughs> How's your bag? My bag's clean. Uh, I must be working harder. Come on. Really press it up. Nice form on the lunge. Really push up. Oh, and my bag is not to keep hammering it down, but. It's sweaty. I gotta get a better grip. I don't know what awesome. bag you're talking about. All right, Spider-Man's. Get knee to elbow. Outside, open up your hip tail. Open up your hips. Foot right down. There you go. Foot right down on this, guys. It's a little bit different. Open up your hips. Your leg should burn after it. You want your foot touching right down. Try to get your knee on the outside of the elbow. Really work it. Work it. Come on, you gotta work it. You want the results. Come on, stay with me. Honey. Stay with me. Come on. I'm here. Good, good. You're just thinking it's easy to stop, Sean. No. No, just don't hit your ass now. Uh, what? Just kicking your butt. Do that. Yeah, but. Uh, 
There you go. Good. Bang. Done. One thing that I really want to mention, and you know my form isn't perfect either, but when you're doing any sort of lunge, try not to collapse the knee in. You'll see it in the video, I collapse my knee in all the time because I just forget to do it. But try to keep the, the knee straight on and try not to come in with it. It's pretty natural for you to want to do that, but try to keep your hips align when you're coming down and the knee straight on. So that's the only thing that I want to just really remind you guys to do. Also, are we done? No, go ahead. Also, um, if the workout felt good, but you could lose the weight to do another one, you can do it without the weight and just use your hands to put it around with all the sandbag workouts. Still do them, just take the weight out. Yeah, you can take the weight out completely if, it's, if you're lower just starting it, or just, just lower it before, before you start. And uh, yeah, that's it. Done.